My name is Brian Hayes. I'm a Salesforce and Pardot consultant with Rotiv. We're an official Salesforce partner that helps small businesses automate their processes. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add campaign member statuses to campaign records. So let's get started. Click on the campaigns tab. And if you're anywhere else in Salesforce, just make your way over to the campaigns object and click on one of your campaign records. Now, what I'm looking at here are all of my related lists. And so this is where you should see campaign member statuses show up, but there's plenty of organizations that I've seen that don't have this related list added to the page layout. So to enable this functionality, which is quite valuable for all sorts of different campaign reports you might wanna run, to add this functionality, we just need to edit the page layout. To do that, click on the setup gear in the upper right-hand corner, and then click on edit object. That's a shortcut that takes us to the object manager for the campaign object. Click on page layouts on the left-hand side, and then click on your campaign layout. You might have multiple layouts there. I just have the one. If you have multiple, click on page layout assignment to see where each layout is used and under what circumstances. I just have the one, so I'm gonna click on that. And then if I scroll down here at the bottom, I can see all of the related lists that are included in this layout. I've got campaign member statuses here, but if you don't, in the toolbox up here, click on related lists, and you should have the option to drag down campaign member statuses and drop it wherever you'd like down here. Once you do that, it should automatically show up on your lightning record, and you can now start customizing and using campaign member statuses as you're running your different marketing projects. I hope that helps. If it did, please click the like button and hit subscribe if you'd like to see more tutorials like this one. Thanks for watching.